starting off the vlog a little bit late because it's just been a super hectic and busy morning but i still wanted to vlog today and i'm actually going to trader joe's in a couple of hours and i was like you know what I'm gonna go ahead and test out this new makeup product that I got from KVD. This is not a sponsored video. I got these with my own money because they were trending on TikTok. And you guys know me. Anything I find on TikTok, I end up buying. Honestly. Most of the items that I've bought so far worked really, really well. So I'm hoping that this one also works, you know, pretty nice on me. But I did like watch Jeffree Star's video doing a review of this product he loved it in the beginning of the video but he ended up like not approving the product i was like dang it where was this video before i bought the product but i still wanted to like give it a shot i already went ahead and applied my sunscreen as well as my moisturizer if you haven't applied your sunscreen please go ahead and apply it start thinking of sunscreen as like putting on deodorant like you have to put it on before you basically do anything before you leave the house it is that important this is like the item right now that everyone's trying to review we're gonna go ahead and try this i'm no beauty guru if you want a dedicated review of this product go watch jeffrey star's video this is what it looks like it comes in this little compact circular packaging i guess i'll just mm -hmm. oh there's not even a mirror here okay so everyone on tiktok all they did was like just one swipe couple swipes and then just like put it right here so i have my mirror right here so let's see as you can see i have a couple i look naked <laughs> don't demonetize me but as you can see i have discolorations here from past breakouts so it's not a bad color should we try the other one okay let me try the other one maybe i should like tested this you know on the other hand i'm, I'm just gonna have to use my hand guys No, okay. Tan 60 is our color. Tan 60. Literally, when I saw the... <gasps> okay, but like, where are my discolorations? Okay, I'm gonna do half of my face, actually. And show you guys the difference. I don't know why my channel was called Beauty Far 06 when i rarely did any beauty i like did beauty here and there but like real okay maybe that's i feel like a little bit of this goes a long way i could have gotten a darker brow shade probably okay blend it. i'll do like one side okay if you're like that's not your shade sis i know it's hard buying foundation online guys one side is this then i'll, I'll blend it out in a bit and then this and let's cover this huge pimple right here okay but like i'm actually super super impressed with the coverage the pimple is pretty much covered you can still see it but as far as like the discoloration goes like it's pretty good okay guys i just finished my makeup i just put on the rest of my makeup this is how the foundation is looking like i actually really like it like as you can tell it covered all of my little um dark spots as well as my pimple you can see this because it's literally like budding but for the most part the coverage 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 um i could have gone with a shade darker but i think we're okay right now i just had to blend the foundation all the way down to my neck um but so far so good i set it with translucent powder from laura mercier put in my blush put in my bronzer highlighter and then just did everything else but yeah so far so good hopefully it's you know it stays intact throughout the day that's the makeup also i've been um using gua sha for the past couple weeks and i can tell a difference with my little non-existent jawline yet um i've been doing it i do it for about five to ten minutes every single night before i go to bed i feel like it's not a farina vlog if we don't open pure packages what could possibly be here there's nothing here. There's a, oh. Ah. 
I did not buy this. Um, I'm actually working with Revlon for their Barbie collection. Little Farina would have been so proud of present Farina right now because I loved Barbie growing up. And look at this. And they also sent this yellow pouch or bag and it has all of the products from the collection. It says Revlon and Barbie. I believe by the time this vlog comes out, my content with them is already going to be out so hopefully i can like show you guys i feel like a lot of things from um like the early 2000s are coming back we have some nail file <gasps> don't talk to me bitch i want spring break and then we got the tweezer set we have another tweezers oh my gosh i can use this to go to the beach oh my gosh so you have this little chevron detail on one side and then the other side i believe it says like revlon and barbie and it's just so crazy guys mm. here we go i am so excited i am so I, let's just go ahead and take this off because I usually wake up around like 5 47 to go to my workout but today I am gonna go to the park walk do my usual walk or run maybe do tennis and then also do a workout I'm currently trying out this new workout that I found on YouTube also I'm currently just peeling an egg right now a hard-boiled egg before I head out to my workout I saw this seven minute for seven day workout challenge on youtube and the feedback from everyone who's done the challenge um were really good so i was like damn for seven minutes every single day like i i can do that this whole week is 80 degrees guys and every like almost 90 degrees i think on thursday it's like 88 degrees in the middle of what well, it'll be like april by then it'll be like april 1st but this whole week everyone in socal is going crazy you'll probably see the beaches full this week because it's summer and we are going outside this is my workout outfit i know my tatas are kind of out right now but that's only because of my little waist trimmer waist trainer um but this fit right here the navy blue one is from shein i hauled it in a couple hauls ago i'll link it down for you guys if it's still available if not I'll link something similar. The waist trimmer is from Amazon. I'm just kind of chilling here. I'm gonna leave like at 10, so I have like 20 more minutes. So I'm just gonna eat this hard boiled egg and I just wanna show you guys my outfit. I'm also eating blueberries right now or blackberries. And oh, I need to prepare my water. Alrighty guys, we finished our run and we just picked the spot at the park. And now I'm gonna do the seven minute for seven day challenge. I'm also gonna be working out some other stuff. So the key thing with this is keep your back nice and straight. If you put in 100%, you get in results of 100% back. So walk your hands out onto the sofa and then come back up. If you find it too hard, come all the way down onto the ground. Right now you are investing in you and your health. When it feels challenging, that's when we really get the results. Really good for working your internal and external obliques, which means these crisscross muscles across your waist have to draw in those tummy muscles we are just doing seven minutes and we're just doing seven days for me non-stop we are going to get amazing results i finished day one there was a floor workout but it's super hot right now and i don't have my mat so the alternative was to just stand up and do the crunch like this it's just like you're lying down except you're standing up so day one
Westfield Mall. We're just gonna, I have to pick up some stuff from Sephora, like a new sunscreen for my face. And then we're gonna have lunch. I got Chipotle for the games, you know? And I got the baby chips and guac on the side. This is so cute. Look at it. It's like 10 pieces. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. and they're so cute so they're originally 98 hello guys i am home now it's been a long day and i'm honestly super super tired and i wasn't gonna unbox some packages today but they're taking up the corner and it's just driving me crazy so we're just gonna have a little chit chat as i go through all of my pr for today hopefully my address is like not anywhere here oh no <gasps> oh shit are these glasses oh freak oh oh so the first package we have is broken. Oh no, I'm so sad. Someone sent me a candle, but <laughs> I don't think they thought this through because the whole thing is broken. I was gonna sit on the floor, never mind. Um, like I said, I have carpet on and I went over it a couple of times. Hopefully they're all gone, but just in case, I do not wanna be sitting down on the floor right now but this is the package that they sent hopefully there's no remaining glasses in here but it's from the brand parade it's a pretty cute packaging it says we can't wait to see how you wear it so let's see what kind of undies they sent Ooh, okay this is super soft what size is this this is a size small this is like boy shorts, but why does this look like it's a medium? Oh my gosh. And then we got this light blue one. This is more of like a cute cheeky boy short. And then last but not least, I feel like their packaging is recyclable. Ooh, we got this really smooth nude underwear. So Thank you so much, Parade. We have the Almay Length and Lift Mascara. These are fragrance-free, hypoallergenic, ophthalmologist tested. First, first said, Day Dissolve Cleansing Balm. I've heard a lot of great things about this product, actually. Then we got the Dew Point Moisturizing Gel Cream. This one is green tea extract and aloe leaf juice. Then I have the Sunday Morning Antioxidant Oil Serum. It has sea buckthorn extract and camellia oil. We also have the Stroke of Brilliance Brightening Serum. This is vitamin C and licorice root extract. The last item I was showing you guys is the shortcut overnight facial peel then we have this little handkerchief super cute so thank you so much verse and verse for the pr from firm abs they sent a couple of workout sets i believe all right so the first one i got is this brown cocoa leggings and it's one of those leggings where it crisscrosses in the front and then i got this light brown bra honestly guys like the material is really nice i've never heard of this brand until they reached out but like this sounds promising oh and this one's different though so this is what the front looks like the back has like these little cargo pockets guys the quality is really freaking nice like i'm actually like kind of shocked so this is this white jacket it goes all the way down it has a little belt on the bottom this shit feels expensive yo Ooh, very cute we got this cream color it has zipper in the middle it's like a little crop top oh my gosh wait this is so cute though <gasps> oh my gosh it is so 
freaking smooth. It is so freaking soft. That is everything I have for this little unboxing. Thank you so much to all the brands that have sent me all these goodies. I really, 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 really am grateful for them. I still cannot believe that, like, I'm doing YouTube. Good morning and happy Thursday. Ugh, I have had such a great morning, um, but I'm feeling a little bit low on the energy. I, as you may or may not know, I don't drink coffee, but I do love matcha. And do I want to order my long matcha order today? And no, not really, but I feel like I need the energy. So I'm going to make Ralph order it for me. Wait, I can always just pick it up. Wait, no, because I'm going to brunch. Okay, anyways, I just want to say good morning. Hi, hello. We are headed out to Marina Del Rey today because I have an event to attend. It's like a food event. Um, they basically just invited me and a couple of my friends or a friend, I guess, because I'm only taking Ralph to come in and like taste their food in exchange for like an Instagram story or post. And I told them like I can just feature you guys in a vlog because I pretty much vlog every single day. <laughs> have a location in Santa Monica but they invited us over to their Marina del Rey location it is brand new and the location is pretty sweet guys it's pretty much like attached to this is that an apartment complex it's like an apartment complex and the surrounding is very serene and quiet and clean and we're just chilling here and then you also have an access to like the port it's so nice here so nice it's so fresh you got orange theory across you can grab your breakfast before you uh, get your workout take a walk by the marina down there so i got the shrooms we got some avocado mushrooms this looks so good you guys look at it very healthy very yummy And also fresh. Alrighty guys, we got the dragon fruit acai bowl. Looks amazing, looks yummy. Look at those colors, summer colors. Hello, summer, where you at? Let's have a little taste test. We got strawberry, apples, and the acai. And I'm not sure what's on the top. Cheers. Oh, oh, cold. This is how I want my homemade acai to taste like. It doesn't taste like this at home, so. This is really good. So, I'm at Sephora because I have to come and exchange my foundation. I got a shade too dark, so let's go ahead and exchange it. Fenty Beauty, you're always sold out. But I'm going to get my color checked just to make sure that it's actually my color because I want number 17. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hello 
guys, good morning and happy, happy Friday, everyone. Today is Friday, so hello weekend, but it's not quite the weekend yet for me just because I just finished filming a Shein haul for you guys and I'm excited for you guys to see it. These are spring and summer items. We got a few bikinis. This top is from Shein, which I really, really love. And I just finished filming the sit down part and the try on and I've literally just been in this little stool right here and I've just been chilling here on my phone resting and we got all that mess right there but um yeah I just wanted to say good morning also I'm getting a haircut V soon I'm gonna dye and cut my hair pretty soon I think next week now the only thing is my hairdresser or like my hair stylist is in Korea at the moment she's on vacation I believe and I ask, oh, when is she coming back? And the lady at the front desk, she's like, oh, she's coming back in September. And I was like, oh. <laughs> like, I really, really need to get my hair done right now. As you can see, my roots are all grown out. And it's okay if it's like... No, it's not okay. I can't even, like, try to justify it. I was gonna say, it's okay if my hair if my hair is curly but no like you can literally tell that my roots have grown out and I have a couple of campaigns that I'm shooting within the next couple of weeks and I also want to get this done before my birthday so I can like kind of like let it grow out and stuff like that and I just cannot wait for her to come back till september so i'm gonna try a new lady from the salon um i'm still going to the same hair salon it's called kim sun young in la literally robin robin is my um hairstylist there she's the only girl i trust from there and she's also like the most senior she's she's been there like for years and she's not here she's literally out of the country but i really need to get my hair done because i have important shoots that i have to do and i literally am just so sick and tired of this ugly like like it doesn't even blend in like the bottom part is okay but it's just because the top part is just mm -mm, it's not it i'm really nervous because i've only really had one person work on my hair for the past couple of years the last time i did it with another person i ended up hating it and robin was there to fix it but now she's like here so pray for your girl we'll see how it goes and yeah i'm still gonna keep it light for now i'm not ready to go on the dark side especially because it's starting to get warm and i feel like lighter hair during the summertime just looks a lot better on me um so yeah we'll probably keep it like this or maybe lighter i don't know what noise i'm I'm nervous taking a little break from cleaning my mess from filming and i wanted to do a little forever 21 haul and they released a collection with juicy couture juicy couture was one of my favorite 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 stores growing up i remember i used to buy those little um charms for the gold bracelets i think i still have them they're probably like somewhere in the house but they recently came out with a collection um so it's like forever 21 and juicy couture the price is actually pretty good considering that juicy couture is a high-end brand i just picked up this pink one and it says it has the original juicy couture logo this little cheeky bottom it says forever and juicy couture so yeah very very cute and then i picked up two bucket hats they're both gonna match with the bikini <gasps> oh my gosh it is so cute I just wish it's a little bit more structured. It's pretty like flimsy, if you ask me, but bro. It's gonna look so cute with the bikini guys. But by the time I post these pictures, they're probably all gonna be sold out, so I'm sorry, but I'll try to link them down below. Filipino boys be like. Um, but yeah, so this is just what it looks like. I cannot wait to wear these to the beach. Oh my gosh. LA said spring who? We skipped spring, guys, and went to summer. I'm gonna have to switch these out to like summer pieces now because it looks like we're not having any 60 degree weathers anymore. 